So this is for to help you out with con finding reciprocals of a fraction. In this, we will um, be able to find you will be able to find a reciprocal of a fraction if you can change a whole number into a fraction or a mixed number into a fraction and then find a reciprocal and the reciprocal is just a flipped fraction. So if it's already a fraction, you can just jump to here and just flip the fraction. But if it's a whole number, you need to change it to a fraction. Or if it's a mixed number, you need to change it to a fraction. And there's also a couple of problems on here where you will be actually looking at when you change it, a division problem into a multiplication problem and you use the idea of a reciprocal. And we'll look at that type of problem too. But on most of these, we'll just be finding the reciprocal and talking about that. Okay, so let's go ahead and start looking at these. Okay, so on this first one, it says, find the reciprocal, what is the reciprocal of four fifths? So we just talked about the reciprocal is just the fraction flipped. So if we start with four fifths, the reciprocal of that is simply just five fourths. So it's just that fraction and you just flip the fraction. So what was the numerator becomes a denominator and the denominator becomes the numerator. So you just simply flip it. And when you type it in, you'll be putting your slash. So you would type it in five and then type it in with a slash four. That's why you have to enter fractions in the Khan Academy lesson. So that's what you do. So again, it's just the fraction flip. Let's go ahead and look at the other one. Okay, so if we get this next one here, what is the reciprocal of five and three sevenths? In order to do this one, mixed numbers do not have reciprocals. Only fractions have reciprocals, so we have to get this into a fraction. And to do this, we need to know how many sevenths are in the five. And we talk about this, we a shortcut, you could we take five and times it by seven so five times seven that tells us there's 35 sevenths plus the three sevenths we have here so that would be five 35 plus three would be 38 sevenths so these two fractions here are equal so Five and three sevenths is equal to 38 sevenths. So what we did is we now have a fraction. And once you have the fraction, you can find the reciprocal of it. So the reciprocal of this is just, again, we just flip the fraction. So it becomes seven over 38. So in order to find a mixed number, you have to get it into an improper fraction first. And then again, to enter this in, it would be seven. And then you'd use your slash and 38 to enter that in the computer. Okay, so again, with mixed numbers, you have to get it into a fraction first, and then you flip it to find the reciprocal. Okay. Now, this one, Con didn't have any like this, but I'd like to talk about this one anyway. So I put it in this video. What is the reciprocal of 52? Well, in order, let's make this, let's make this whole number of 52 into a fraction. We can make it into a fraction by simply putting 52 over one. And then these are equivalent because anything over one is still just the number itself. So 52 over one, because it's just like 52 divided by one. And so the reciprocal of that would be one over 52. So the reciprocal of a whole number is just one over that number. And that works for any whole number. It's because of this, because we can put any whole number over one to turn it into a fraction, and then we can just flip it to make the reciprocal. Okay, so that's just finding the reciprocal. That's what these problems are about. The other ones you'll end up with are like this on con. And it will ask you, 
um, choose all that apply. So I want you to fill this out. So we have five divided by two ninths. We've talked about how we can change that into a multiplication if we have five times the reciprocal of two ninths. And it says choose all the answers that apply. So we can see down here that D is one that works because if we flip this one, we would have nine halves. So D is one that would work. But on this, we need to be careful because it also says choose all that apply. Also, the reciprocal of two ninths, which is nine halves, would work. So your answer can be this reciprocal of two ninths is what goes in here. Because what goes in here is nine over two. So that can be either nine over two or the reciprocal of two nights. That's what answer. Most of these are going to have two answers like this. It'll be the actual fraction and then the reciprocal of the original fraction is what will be going in there for your answer. And that's what you'll be doing on these. Okay. So it'll be the fraction that you would put in the box and the reciprocal of the original fraction that you'll be choosing to go in there. So if you have questions with these, we've this is what's setting us up for our multiply by the reciprocal. And that's how we divide, do fractions involving, that's what we do, division involving fractions is we multiply by the reciprocal. All right, good luck with these, and let me know if you have any questions. Have a good day. Bye.